Hello and welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at transponders, the different modes, and the uses of transponders. What is a transponder? A transponder is an electronic unit, installed on an aircraft, which sends information such as the aircraft identification, barometric altitude, to ground station, and to other aircraft. The information sent to the ground, is used to determine the position of the aircraft. And the information sent to other aircraft, is used for the Traffic Alert and Collision Avoidance System, or TCAS. How does a transponder function? The transponder takes data from different computers, on board the aircraft. When an interrogation signal is sent by a ground station, the transponder sends the aircraft data as a response signal. On aircraft installed with Automatic Dependent Surveillance Broadcast, or ADSB, the data is continuously sent, at regular intervals, without the interrogation signal. Modes of Transponders Mode A. This transponder only sends an aircraft identity code. Mode C. This transponder sends the aircraft's altitude information. Mode S. This transponder has the capability of selective interrogation. Selective interrogation refers to an interrogation signal, which is meant for one particular aircraft. Only that aircraft will send a reply signal, with the identity and altitude information. These transponders can interrogate with aircraft having Mode A or Mode C transponders. Advantage of Mode S transponder A Mode C transponder sends altitude information in 100 feet increments. A mode S transponder sends altitude information in 25 feet increments. Mode S transponders can have ADSB out or ADSB in function. The ADSB out function transmits different aircraft parameters such as location, altitude, speed to ground stations. The ADSB in function allows ground stations to transmit weather and traffic information, to different aircraft. The transponders on different aircraft, interact with each other, for the TCAS, or traffic alert, and collision avoidance system. Depending on the distance, or the time to collision, the TCAS generates alerts in the cockpit, in both the aircraft, to avoid a collision. The transponders use the aircraft data, to give opposite orders to the aircraft. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe.